So, di mga tips si fried chicken ang ating recipe. Gagawin natin yung old-fashioned style. Simple yung recados, simple yung proseso, pero super crispy, tender, juicy, finger licking good. At syempre gagawin na natin yung madalian niya, pero nakatataan because cooking doesn't have to be hard, it just have to be delicious. Let's go! Drumsticks or legs ng manok ang gagamitin natin para sa ating fried chicken. Pero syempre pwede din dyan yung thigh or wings. Basta part na mabuto, yun yung masarap na pang prito. First step natin is ibabrine muna natin itong mga chicken. Kaya meron tayo ditong tubig at lalagyan natin yan ng asukal. Sa mga 4 to 5 cups na tubig, lagyan natin ng mga 1 cup na asukal at 1 cup din na asin. So 1 is to 1 siya. Then lagyan natin ng dahon ng laurel para may konting bango. Tapos haluin lang natin para matunay yung asukal at saka yung asin sa tubig. Tapos isubmerge na natin yung mga drumsticks. Dapat nakalubog siya sa tubig mga katipsi, no? At ibababad natin to ng 30 minutes to 1 hour. Huwag masyadong matagal kasi baka naman umalat yung mga manok at huwag din naman mabilis. Kasi baka hindi naman dumikit yung panlasang nilagay natin. After natin mababad, ahuni na natin to. Ilagay lang natin dito sa plato. And then, gawa na tayo ng butter. Gagamit tayo dyan ng all-purpose flour at cornstarch. So, 1 is to 1 lang din. Halimbawa, 1 cup yung gagamitin yung flour, 1 cup din dapat yung cornstarch. At para mas maging crunchy, lalagyan natin yan ng mga isa hanggang dalawang kutsarang baking powder. Pagpalasa natin, asin at maraming ground black pepper para medyo spicy yung flavor natin. Kahit madami yan mga katipsi, okay lang yan. Dahil kapag prinito na natin to, halos kalahatin itong mga seasoning natin is mapupunta lang sa mantika. Kung ayaw nyo naman na maanghang, konting paminta lang ilagay nyo. At eto mga katipsi, optional lang dahil available naman dito, paprika. At para mas maging spicy, kain powder. Or pwede din kayong gumamit ng chili powder. Pero kahit asin at paminta lang mga katipsi, okay na yun. Para old-fashioned na Filipino style. And then, haluin lang natin mabuti. After natin mamix, lalagyan na natin to ng tubig para mag-create tayo ng butter. Dapat medyo malapot yung texture niya mga katipsi, kaya tansyahin na lang natin. Pag napansin nyo na hindi pa malapot, dagdagan nyo lang ng tubig. Hanggang sa makuha nyo yung consistency ng lapot na gusto nyo. At patuloy lang natin haluin hanggang sa maging ganito na siya. Hindi malabnaw, hindi rin masyadong malapot. Yung tamang-tama lang. Ganun lang kasimple mga katipsi, no? After natin mabrine, gumawa tayo ng butter. Ngayon, ipiprito na natin yan. Kaya magpapainit na tayo ng mantika dito sa ating wok. Kapag mga 350 Fahrenheit na yung init ng mantika, pwede na natin simulan na magprito mga katipsi kasi bababa pa yung temperature niya kapag lagay natin itong mga manok. Iko-coat lang natin tong mga chicken dito sa ating butter tapos diretso na natin tong ipiprito. Ganun lang kasimple at ganun lang kadali mga katipsi. Wala na tayong ilalagay na breading. Ganito lang talaga kabilis ang pagpiprito ng old style na fried chicken. Wala masyadong arte, simpleng simple lang yung proseso. At sa pagpiprito mga katipsi, lalo ng fried chicken, huwag nating i-overcrowd yung wok para maluto siya evenly. Kasi kapag siniksik natin yung mga manok dyan, masyadong bababa yung temperature ng mantika, ang tendency yung ibang manok, mabibigla, yung ibang manok naman may hilaw. Kaya huwag nating i-overcrowd yung pagpiprito. Pag nakuha na natin yung init ng mantika, ilagay lang natin sa medium to high heat yung apoy ng kalan. Naka deep fry yung mga chicken at ipipirito natin to ng 15 minutes. Ang isang paraan para malaman mong luto na ang manok is kapag lumutang na yan sa mantika at kapag nakuha na natin yung golden brown na gusto nating mga chip tulad dito luto na to. Para mas makasigurado tayo since meron tayo dito ng meat thermometer eh gamitin natin. Para sa chicken dapat yung loob nyan is nasa temperature ng 150 to 160 Fahrenheit para masabi mong talagang luto siya. At ayun nga, siguradong luto na tong mga manok natin. Ahunin na natin to at palamigin para mas lalo pang maging crispy. At bago natin isunod yung second batch mga katipsi, linisin muna natin itong mantika ayan, para hindi masunog. Itong mga humiwalay na fried butter. Dahil lang isang sikreto din mga katipsi ng magandang texture na fried chicken is dapat malinis yung mantika. Prito na natin lahat ng chicken. Kung may kita nyo mga katipsi, napakaganda ng kulay. Napakasimple at napakabilis na ng proseso natin pero napakaganda naman ng resulta. Mamaya malalaman natin kung juicy ba to sa loob at masarap pa yung kinalabasan. itong fried chicken natin na nakita nyo golden brown na golden brown so syempre tara kahit tayo
kain tayo. Yahoo! <laughs> oh, ating sino na tunay yung simple, very, very simple na dish natin today, fried chicken, bro. And we have, uh, <laughs> what is it, guest? A special or guest. Special guest, ghost fire gaming. Yung mga hiling sa games dyan, isang pagkain pa kayo brother ko, ghost fire gaming. Ayan. Long time start. no see. Oh, yeah. And Sa mga naghahanap, for those who are yeah. looking for Junior, yeah. ano siya? He's back. Ngayon lang siya but nagka-time. But not all the time. Yeah. Ngayon mm-hmm. lang siya nagka-time because mm-hmm. it's your day off, right? Yeah. And our day yeah. off, we don't have like Anything to errands work. today yeah. to go yeah. out. Yeah. That's yeah. why we have time to eat together. Yeah. You yeah. want the rice or the mashed potato? Probably mashed potato. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Mawa si mama na mashed potato, mm. rice. May mag-rice ako muna. Yeah. Amaya na to. Yeah. Yeah. Ayan, yeah, simulan na natin ito mga katipsi. Let's go! go. <laughs> so you said basic, basic fried yeah, chicken. Just yeah. the classic one. The old-fashioned way. What, what do you Banana. mean by old-fashioned? Old-fashioned means there's no... No, no, no drama. Just a simple ingredients. Simple okay. seasoning. Salt, pepper. That's okay. it. That's it. Butter. No... No boom, boom, boom. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, a little boom, boom, boom. Do you air fry it or what you do? No, just, oh. this is the, the old-fashioned fry. The old-fashioned. Old okay. Yeah. Lahat ng ginawa natin dito mga tipsy for puro old style. Nakita niyo naman, sobrang simple lang ng dish ng recipe. Ng, sobrang simple lang ng seasoning na nilagyan natin. We just put salt, pepper. And then, I just added cayenne and paprika. Okay. Just because we're here in the US, so it's available. So we added it to have a little spiciness in it. Okay. Cool. Now let's eat. Let's try it. <laughs> mm-hmm. I'm chopped up. Huh? You're right. Yeah. Crunchy. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely a difference when you mm-hmm. air fry it versus mm-hmm. you go air fry it. I like that. Mm-hmm. There's a little taste of sweetness mm-hmm. because I brine it with sugar and salt. Mm-hmm. How um how hot did you have to have the oven to fry it? Um, for for the oil, mga tipsy, ah, that's a good question because that's very important. Mm-hmm. Um, you you set it to 350. Okay. Fine, high because the first time you put the the chicken, the it suddenly changed the the temperature, right? So put it to 350, yung oil, and then I think maintain it to 220 to 250. Okay. So you will cook it like and equally. The medium high, so you're gonna do the oil. Yeah. Oh. In the, um, it should be oh, medium. Not in the oven, oven. Yeah, it should be medium to high. Okay. Medium, medium high. high. Okay. Not too high because para mas ulo naman siya mga tips. Hindi and dito, hindi dito <laughs> It's very important to, when you're frying a chicken. It's very important the heat. That's why Junior asked that mm-hmm. that question. Mm-hmm. The the temperature mm-hmm. of the oil. Because look at what inside. Cook mm-hmm. talaga siya. Hindi mm-hmm. tapin kis tapin kis. Hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Very tender, very juicy. Mm-hmm. There's still moist in it. Mm-hmm. There you go. It's not dry because we brine it. That's the good thing about brining. Okay. What do I mean to brine? You soak it with water, salt, and uh, sugar. Mm-hmm. And then I just add the, the bay leaves to mm-hmm. have a little, you know. So is that like marinated? Kinda. Kinda. So you're just like putting the chicken inside that bowl? Mm-hmm. Yeah, with okay. water. Okay. Yeah. For how long? 30 minutes to one hour. Okay. Don't uh, soak it more than an hour because it may taste very salty. Mm-hmm. Don't soak it as well for like too fast because yeah. the, the seasoning might not... Yeah, it's not too fast. 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 It's not It's different. It is crispy too. Yeah, it's mm-hmm. not spicy at all. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That was normal. Huh? We put a lot of uh, ground black pepper in it because in the process of cooking those seasonings, mm-hmm. it will lessen like 50%. Mm-hmm. So even you put a lot of, of spiciness mm-hmm. in it, it will be able to it. Even you don't dip it to the sauce, mm-hmm. it's delicious. Yeah. Right? Mm-hmm. I like it. It's not too much. It's soft. Yeah. And they're very they're up. juicy. And there's uh, ketchup here. You can also put it there. Yeah. Yeah. Different, it's yeah, different. Mm-hmm. Then, uh, they said classic, mm-hmm. and different. Yeah. Nung unang panahon kasi mga katipsi, ganito lang tanong tayo kasi mm-hmm. magluto ng mga fried chicken, di ba? Mm-hmm. Salt and pepper lang. And yung cayenne and paprika, inad na lang natin yung kasi available para medyo may spiciness. So, it's more okay. But I don't, I don't okay. taste the, the spicy. No, no, no. no. It's just good. I like how it's fried. It's fried nice. Mm-hmm. Good. Kaman tama yung pagkakaluto. Sobrang dambot, crispy, tender, and juicy. Finger looking good. No. That's not spicy, right? Finger looking good. It's really good. Napakasimple mga katipsi, pero tinan mo nyo ano. Ang sarap mga katipsi. What kind of oil do you use? Like, I think it's vegetable. Vegetable. From Costco. 
Go go back on the man. Like how it's dried and stuff. Mm-hmm. Like crazy. Ah, because we're used to the air fry all the mm-hmm. time. Mm-hmm. Well, mm-hmm. I can't. When it comes to the chicken, mm-hmm. like the wings that we have, like mm-hmm. the small drumsticks, that's good for air frying. Yeah. But when I when I would air fry the drumstick, like mm-hmm. these ones right here, it wasn't as good. No. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. It's not that good. Yeah. Like it doesn't feel like it fries that well. It doesn't make it crispy at all. So. I... And it's not juicy inside if you air fry because they it, it evaporated everything. Yeah, it just didn't taste as good. I think the other those other ones, those other drumsticks make sense. Well, like this one. I can't even eat the the bones. No. Why they so brown moist though? Yep. Masarap. Masarap talaga pag samahin yung sugar and salt. Same amount lang. If you use one cup sugar, one, one cup salt, mm-hmm. put it in water, line it for 30 to, to one hour. Why the sugar? I don't know, man. But <laughs> just for a little sweet, I think. Yeah. Because if you combine salt and uh, sugar, it's like, I don't know, it's like, mm-hmm. right? I don't know. I don't know that. It's a good combination. Taste, right? It's a good, good combination, but I don't know why. why, why. <laughs> That's why it's a good combination. when we cook, Filipino food, sometimes mm-hmm. you put sugar in it. Yeah. Right? No, we always. Yeah, yeah. mom put sugar yeah. in spaghetti. Oh, uh, spaghetti sauce. Why you do that? <laughs> For my time, Gayo, going into my kitchen. Actually, Madalina, no, it's a mm-hmm. very easy recipe. Mm-hmm. You just have to wait for the brining is just like 30 to an hour and then make a butter. We just make like a butter only. We don't because sometimes we put it on like a breading. Because the other way, the usual way of others, like there's a butter and then there's a breading, right? Before you cook it. Here, just butter. The way you fry it, it's, it's, uh, reminds me, like it reminds me of a like Columbia. Because like, like, mm-hmm. uh-huh. I don't use vegetable oil at home. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, I think they're using avocado oil. Avocado right? oil. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Sa mga birthday mga katilos eh, pwede to. Birthday, mm-hmm. celebration, because in the Philippines man, in all sort of kind of celebrations, mm-hmm. we always have chicken. Yeah. That's <laughs> Fried good. Chicken. You have yeah. to have chicken. Ah. Kahit anong part ng manok naman mga katilos eh, okay. Pero para sa akin kasi when it comes to frying, mm-hmm. fried chicken, those dark meat has the base taste part. Yung mga mabubuto. Mm-hmm. Thigh, legs, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. Yun talaga yung pang prito. Wings. Wings, yeah. Hmm. Kami, di ba? <laughs> ah, I want to shout out Sir Romy. Mm-hmm. Sir Romy? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Like it oh, yeah. bro? Yeah, I like it. Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Very simple dish, mga katipsi. Pwede nyo subukan. This is an everyday food. Mm-hmm. Pwede nyo enjoy. Mm-hmm. Kasi napakadali lang. Well, maybe not so every day because it's fried food. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe not so every day. Yeah. <laughs> but any kind of day. <laughs> not every day. Not every day. Not any kind of yeah, day. Like yeah, a bunch of dinner and stuff. Yeah, yeah right, right. Yeah. Yeah. Ayun mga tipsy, siguro hanggang dito lang naman yung video natin. Hindi ko na papahabain. Pero huwag nyo mo nang uh, i-end. No? Kasi meron tayong bonus clip. Uh, isa, mm-hmm. Next na, next na yung bonus clip. Para sabahan nyo kami mag-celebrate dito nung Thanksgiving natin. Siyempre para kasama nyo rin natin. Uh-huh. Pero hanggang dito na lang muna, sana nagustuhan nyo yung simpleng simpleng putahin natin, pero masarap naman. Kaya mo hindi pa nakasubscribe dyan, please i-click nyo na yung subscribe button. Tapos i-ring nyo rin yung bell para update kayo sa food. Ito, and good vibes natin. And please subscribe to the Sparrow Gaming, my brother. And always remember, stay tipsy lang. Salud! Ang gol. Tolok na. For a long time, I haven't eaten the real fried chicken. <laughs> yeah, we get a lot of air fryer, mm-hmm. but it, that, that's really soft. And crunchy. Mm-hmm. <laughs>
Where's your plate? Hey, hey. thanks. Tata's first Thanksgiving. Yeah, this is my first Thanksgiving. It's nice juicy. Man. Yeah. How long did you cook it? Four hours. Oh, really? Four hours and that come out like that? Yeah. Just on your plate yeah. and then you drizzle some some yeah. gravy. gravy on top of it. Who likes the wings? It's yeah. a big one. There, this is, this is it? You said the small one. <laughs> <laughs> you said small wing, you can't eat a lot. Is this your play here, Mom? Yeah. You said small wing. There. How about that? There. Looking to our sister. Uh, this is for the vlog, sis. Oh! <laughs> yeah. yeah. Happy, Boom. Happy Thanksgiving! Boom! <laughs> yeah. There you go. <laughs> Eh, yun yung kapatid ko babae mga katip sila sa New Orleans sila nakatira ngayon. Tapos may isa pa akong kapatid na babae kakambal ko naman sa Pilipinas. Uh, someday mamimit niyo rin sila sa video. Why Americans celebrating Thanksgiving? Uh -huh. He doesn't know. I don't know. No. We don't know. Tradition, know. Traditionally? Yeah. Mm -hmm. What well, are you talking? Are you asking about like the original? What's the history? Why? How did it start? What, 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 I just looked it, it up. It started uh, 1621. The original. Oh wow! Mm. Before, before yeah, the United States, States would be even a country. Oh really? Yeah. I think it was just a time to help each other out. I think both. Oh. Okay. Or I think the. Settlers were struggling, and I think the Native Americans wanted to help them out. Um, mm -hmm. But I think it coincides. I think originally it coincides with um, harvest. I think Thanksgiving is a harvest yeah. festival. Yeah. Oh, okay. Like yeah, every season there is. That's why there's so much. They food. celebrate uh, okay. planting, and then this one's a celebration of harvest. And you give thanks. Oh, okay. Then I have another harvest. question. Okay. Why turkey? Why I don't think I think, think that's part of Roosevelt's thing. Yeah, it was. Oh, okay. a, it, it came out through the Depression. Oh, what? Actually, this is... that's what's actually declared uh, a holiday. Oh. Thanksgiving. Uh -huh. Before that, it wasn't. I think turkey might have been oh, the only really? available yeah. protein at the time. Because oh, okay. before, different proteins like beef is. We sh like Americans weren't eating beef regularly. Mm -hmm. They weren't even eating chicken. Actually, yeah. it was like, huh? It's just hard to come by. Mm -hmm. Like they had. Uh, they told you it's the lobster. The story oh, yeah. of the lobster during the depression, mm -hmm. where they yeah. used to have so much lobster get on shore yeah. to where there was just too much. So mm -hmm. it used to be called the poor food. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, the lobster. Because mm -hmm. it used to just fall the poor, onto the shores. Poor, poor food. Used to yeah. 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 Used to, yeah. Used to just come onto the shore like in droves. Mm -hmm. There was just so much lobster mm -hmm. all oh, this way. on the shore. But right now it's like rich people only. Yeah, and it used to be a poor person. Like if they found out. You ate you ate lobster. They they would make fun of you. Oh right. Because like, oh, yeah, it's a harvest festival to celebrate like a good harvest mm -hmm. um, and mm -hmm. future prosperity. We're going to tayo kumain mga tips na main dish natin na turkey. Dessert naman tayo ngayon. Pumpkin pie. Yeah, this is my first time eating it. <laughs> you American now. <laughs> You are right, bro. It's good. Yeah. Yeah.